Okay, you guys, these are some live trades I was able to take um, while uh, on vacation with my wife uh, for Mother's Day. Um, but I just want to show these to you. So as you can see, I took a buy on the Euro New Zealand off the 15 minute. As you can see, everything lined up perfectly. We had the long term trend, short term trend, the arrow, smiley face, everything lined up. And then we checked the 30 minute. And as you can see, the 30 minute at the time price action was coming out of the green zone. One hour price action was also in the green zone. And then if you check the four hour, you see it's sitting right in the green zone on the four hour. So that's why I took that trade and currently up 109 pips. Let's take a look at another trade that I'm in right now. Um, and that is the Euro AUD. I also took that one. Same reason. Arrows here. Everything lined up. Nice conservative trade because the short term bias and the long term bias was also saying up. And then again, the 30 minute. You see in the green zone. Price in the green zone on the one hour. And if you check on the four hour, you can see it's clearly bouncing off of the lower. And that's why I don't have a take profit on this one. I'm gonna let this one run for a little while. Because as I mentioned before, the arrow may begin on the shorter time frame, but over time it may even move up to the higher time frames. And as you can see, it moved up to the 30 minute. Next, it may matriculate up to the one hour. And if so, hopefully it'll move up to the four hour like it did here for this mass move and we'll have a nice trade there but we'll see i'll be scaling out of it moving my stop loss up uh accordingly like i'll do here then last below the last swing low to lock in even more profit and then we have a couple of more let's take a look at this one here and this is one that uh of the signals i sent out to the signals group let's take a look at that one and as you can see it's near our take profit and I'm up 112 pips on this one. As you can see, here's my position and everything. This is again a conservative trade. Why? Because everything lined up. If it was a aggressive trade, it would only be either the upper or the lower that would match in color, but both of these matched. And then again, we have the 30 minute. As you can see, perfect. One hour, perfect. And again, you only need to check one or two time frames higher, but sometimes since I'm here, I just check and see what's going on in the higher time frame just to get an idea. And as you can see, the higher time frame has just been choppy, so no big deal there. We're making good pips on this one. And then let's take a look at another one, GBPAUD. Okay, and this one, as you can see, it was a, what I call a sidewinder. It went sideways for a little while and then shot up, and I'm up 269 pips on this one. And uh, you can see here, that the 30 minute has it in the zone here and the one hour is in the zone here and the four hours also in the zone so these are how you pick your good trades you patiently wait for them but uh, once they come out they work pretty well and as you can see here a sell signal came in here that's why you have the evidence dot there and clearly you can tell I did not take it uh, why because according to the rules you do not want to take a sale signal when it's too close or inside of another zone. So a sale zone would be red. Okay, and so with the signal, as you can see, you have red here. Signal came in here because the market was going sideways. This is one of the other reasons why I tell you if you're not sure about how to trade a sideways market and just stay out of it because it gets real choppy before it makes an explosive move and as you can see this one went sideways for quite a bit and that's the reason why you have the ups and downs and the signal came in but i avoided that when i just actually added a position here on the pullback on it and as you can see here also it would have been an aggressive because only one would have matched the color as you can see this would have been red with a red arrow red smiley faces but the long-term trend said green and this is the benefit of checking on the higher time frames because by knowing that the 30 minute and the one hour and now even on this one the four hour all in the buy zone you clearly knew not to take this signal so even though this is an evidence dot 
we wouldn't have lost on this trade because we never would have took it. OK. All right. So these are some good examples of great trades uh, that you can do and take with the system. It's very easy to use. Very simple. Very straightforward. OK.